of the Corvette and a truck pulling lawn equipment. Who's going to beat each other out? Because there's one lane closed in the lane where we're turning. Who's going to win? Who's going to win? Who's going to win? Go, go, go! <laughs> the truck won. Speaking meet up and I ran a few errands, went to the grocery store and got my loaf of bread from the bakery that I always that I like to get. I have a massive headache like I had when I woke up this morning and I can't wait to get home to the kitty cat. I'm about a mile and a half from home. Yes, the next project I have to do is cut all these down, put them in boxes for uh, kindling wood or for my barbecue right there. Yep, that'll be happening soon. Been doing odds and ends. Uh, vacuum, now I'm going to, with my rug cleaner, I'm going to clean the carpet. And I don't know if you can see, is it the wooden fence? There's a bunch of rubbish they took out. They left there in a big pile. They have a giant dog behind there in a small small enclosure and he's been barking he barks all night long he's a big soft fuzzy looking teddy bear of a dog but they're training him they keep him in a small pen and they basically want him to bark so that people don't come around he's a sweetheart of a dog but I tell you one thing if you got near me probably chew you in half I don't like that that's not cool don't do that to your animals be responsible pet owner be kind to your pets. Finally, by about 12.30, 1 o'clock in the afternoon, I actually felt human and able to move around. Why does this happen, and why certain times of the day and night? I have no idea. It doesn't matter what I eat or drink or anything. It just happens to me. And there's nothing I can do about it. I don't want to take a lot of pain pills or drink booze or anything, because that's not a solution. That's only masking problems that are there. It's not taking care of anything. It's just uh, numbing the symptoms. And I'm afraid that most of American medicine is like that. I don't know about other countries, but I prefer a more holistic approach. I mean, pain comes from somewhere. Whether it's legitimate or if it's a phantom pain that's caused by some mixed signals in your brain, it comes from somewhere. If you don't get to the root of the problem, it's like a horrible poisonous weed in your garden. You can chop the top off, but it's going to grow again. And again and again. And it might spread. If you don't get the whole plant out by the root, then you won't get rid of the problem. Same thing with disease, basically. Ooh, I'm being all philosophical here. <laughs> I had to show you the sky. The sky is gorgeous. Where can I show you the sky? Oh, hush. Oh, hush, hush, hush. Here is my television antenna. <laughs> I'm one of the few people that still have one. Isn't that pretty? Oh, isn't that pretty? Oh, a bunch of birdies. Hello, birdies. Don't poop on me. Oh, that looks so cool. Some weird looking patterns there. Really cool. Kind of like an, an interesting symphony if you drew lines in the sky. Oh, one last little guy strand. He's late. He's late. He's like me. Late. A lot to do. And I had vacuumed the floor and mopped the kitchen floor. I'm going to totally wash out the cat litter box before I put some fresh in there and uh, do all the dishes yes all the dishes are in the sink and part of them in the dishwasher all the forks are gone out of the drawer even the emergency fork I have like a, a fork that doesn't match the others so when I reach the point where I have to use that fork I spank myself and tell myself that you need to do the dishes yeah. I like a fine cheese that sits around and ages, becomes very stinky, so I took a shower. 
The cat and I had tuna burgers for dinner, which he loved very much. I watched on my little DVD player that I have uh, something I checked out from the library. The BBC TV series Doctor Who from 1963 through 66. The very, very beginning. It's pretty interesting. It's in black and white. So I'll be watching that before I have to turn it in next Saturday. I'm still in a lot of pain. Don't understand it at all. Hopefully I'll get some kind of sleep tonight and uh, have stuff to do like try to get my car inspected and stuff this week. I have a few other things that are going on this week, but uh, we'll, we'll tackle that later. Upward and onward.